Hello students. Let's try to understand a problem. Our first order reaction is 40% complete in 50 minutes. Calculate the value of rate constant. In what time will the reaction be 80% complete? So first order reaction is there student. So if you are writing rate constant, it is 2.303 student upon T and log what is their student r not upon r student now what we need to do student you just plug out the value what is the time student 50 minutes they are talking about 50 minutes here is log there initial concentration let it be the r not student the initial concentration it should be the r not only okay now what is the final concentration so initial minus the resulting one how much student 40 percent so r not minus 40 percent that is 40 upon 100 or not that is 40 percent of initial is decomposed so let's try to understand here student 2.303 it is going to be 50 this is going to be r not here what we will write student this is going to be and again it is the r not student divided by r not minus what is the 0 0.4 and this is again going to be what student r not so 2.303 upon 50 student this is log this r not we are taking the going to be the going to be the common student we are going to take this r not common in the denominator so r not is the numerator in denominator 1 minus 0 0.4 this is there and downside it is going to be r not a student in the numerator and denominator it is cancel out 2.303 upon 50 it is going to be log here is 1 upon 1 minus 0 0.4 means 0 0.6 student right so dear student what we will be able to do in this case so we need to plug out the value student ok so first of all you divide this one the 1 by it will be 0 0.6 student so it is going to be here 2.303 student divided by 50 long it is going to be 1.66 student right now if you place plug the value of the log student so we will be able to get the answer so we are just finding out the value of log 1.66 So it is going to be student 2.303 upon 50. It is log student. Its value is coming student log 1.66. Its value is how much student 0 0.220. Right. Um, now you just multiply the obtained value student. So 2. 303 multiply by 0 0.220 divided by 50 student so its value is coming student 0 0.01013 and this is minute inverse student because here you can see in the question how much they have given 50 minutes so this is the rate constant value student of dear student the second part they are saying how much time will how much time will the reaction be 80 percent complete so for 80 percent completion for 80 percent completion very easily you can calculate student this one so time they are asking now student 2.303 upon k this is log initial concentration is r not final concentration is r of dear student you see 2.303 
k value just now obtained student you know k value is always constant for particular reaction 0.01 0 0.01 0 0 3 so here we are writing the 3 log what is the initial concentration it will be the r not only let it be here is final concentration final concentration that is initial minus left one so that is how much 80 percent so 80 by what is student 100 and here will be what or not now solve it student so 2.303 upon 0 0.01013 this is log student this is going to be the r naught divided by what is student if you are solving this is going to be r naught <coughs> minus 0 0.8 again it is r naught of student little bit solve more 2.303 upon 0 0.01013 this is the log student here is the r naught student divided by 1 minus 0 0.8 the here is the what they are student r naught so friend what will happen this r naught r naught will be cancelled out so 2.303 student 0 0.01013 and log here 1 by 0 0.2 student because if you are subtracting 1 minus 0.8 student 0 0.2 will come Ab now student what we are going to do 0.2 divided by no 1 divided by 0.2 if you are doing student will come 5 so 2.303 student 0 0.01013 here is the log 5 Ab now student you should know the value of log 5 student okay you need to memorize the value of log 5 then if you see log 5 value student so 2.303 divided by 0 0.01013 multiply by log 5 value is 0 0.6989 student now what we need to do we are going to multiply this all the data student so 2.303 multiply by point six nine eight nine six nine eight nine and this will be divided by point zero one zero one three so it is coming a student one fifty eight point eight nine minutes so this is exactly hundred percent correct student so time required for eighty percent student so one fifty eight minutes so this is all about the answer student Thank you so much for watching dear friends.